Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Transport Fever 2 on the Longland map. So this time around, we're going to bring in uh, food deliveries into Shangri-La and Atlantis, right? Uh, and now I was scoping it out and I'm pretty sure we can put a uh, freight station here to uh, deliver to the... Um, to the uh, the area here that demands food and this I think will be a terminus station uh, right so if we put it here yeah that should work fine and we'll also need a station up here at Shangri-La which will uh, will be uh, a thing uh, now I'm looking at this and I can, I could peel off a track from here and I can come up through Shangri-La and come in at the existing uh, station here, which I can expand for freight, uh, and then down into Atlantis. And I think that's what I'm going to do. So, that's going to require rejiggering this here station. So uh, we're going to do this, this on pause uh, because I need to um, do this. Uh, okay, so we're going to go in here and we're going to extend it by one in... Why can't I build there? Okay, configure. Uh, by one in each direction there, we'll extend the passenger platform by one. Okay. And I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to do something. Right, I'm going to put uh, a couple of uh, bypass through tracks in. Uh, no, 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 and then I'm going to put a uh, freight platform. <coughs> okay, that gets me a freight platform in there, right? Okay, now uh, I need to come out here with the... Uh, with the two, okay. So we need to come out here like so, which will be flat, okay. And if we do that, oh yeah, we're good. Now, I'm going to need also to bring this one out and uh, yeah, we'll uh, go just a little bit further here and do this. Yep, and slip that. Okay, so that gets us access into that platform. Uh, right. Now, um, this needs to back up a little bit further, right? Uh, and then this will come straight through on the level okay like that and we will also uh, do this um, so that we can deliver and then continue if we choose to right and this is the passenger line which will reduplicate here Right? Okay. Now, we do this, and this, and I think this will connect around. Yes, it does. Good. Good. Okay. Now, we need to re-signal this, right? And uh, over here as well. Like that. Okay. 
So I believe that will get us most of the stuff we need there. Now, we need to go in here and uh, configure this with a cargo building. Uh, if we put it here, we get a tendril. Yeah, we get a tendril. So we'll put it there. And yeah, that covers uh, pretty much everything that we need to cover there. Good. Now, here we need to get around past the town. So if we take this around like this and do that, not quite. Um, if we do this, Yeah, I think if we were to do that, okay. Yeah, I think we can, we can possibly make it work that way. Okay. Now, coming out, we want to peel off right here. Okay. So we'll get rid of this signal and we need to peel off basically like this. And then you Is that tolerable? Um Hmm. Yeah, I think that's better. Yeah, we'll go with that. Okay. And from here, we do this. Good. Yes. Okay. Well, put the signal back. Okay. And we need one here. Yeah. Okay. Good. Now, what you need to do, uh, I need to connect the track up. Aha. You have uh, apprehended the necessary thing here. I've apprehended it, have I? Yeah, yeah, you've apprehended it. Okay, so we're going to do this. We're going to back that up just a little bit. And make that one a trench. Okay, nope. Not like that. Uh, and then this can come around and connect like that. You know what? I think this might be better if I trench it. And then put a uh, road bridge. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to trench this and uh, streets. Uh, we want that one. And we do this. Now, uh, what bridge? Oh, that bridge will work. That doesn't seem strong enough, does it? Uh... That one doesn't have enough clearance. Okay. Uh, no. Now that's just different colors. Um, no, that one's not going to work. But Jolly Green might. Yeah, we'll take Jolly Green on that one. Right. Okay, so that is better. Now, you know what? I think I'm going to do the uh, trench. Or cut for the whole thing. Yeah. Um, 
Yeah, it doesn't look egregious, so I think I'll definitely do that. Yeah, that looks okay. Uh, I'm good with it. Okie dokie. Well, uh, if you're good with it, put some signals on it. Well, what did you think I was going to do? Well, I assume you were going to put some signals on it. Ah, I see. Okay, and we're going to need one here and one here. Yeah. And one here and one here. Okay. Now you need to come down here and bang a station in. Yeah, and, and we're going to just bang in a terminus station, right? Yeah. That should be all we need here is a terminus station. So if we were to do that, yeah, take a million to build that roughly, uh, but we can definitely do that. Uh, that's a good enough name for it too, I think. Now, let us see if we can just uh, bang a track up here and have it work. Looks like we can. Well, let's just do that then. Yeah, that will uh, that will work. Do that. Okay, we banged a track in there. Uh, you need a couple more signals on that. Yeah, I rather suspect I do. Uh, probably right about like that, and right about like that is too many. But it's the number you're going to put in there, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it is. Okay, so now, what do we need? We need a couple of trains to come down from the food place, which is way over here. Where's the depot? Where did you put the depot? I put a depot over here. Oh, okay. You are going to need to connect up another platform. Am I? Yeah, you probably, I probably am. Okay. I'm going to connect up a platform. Okay, so how are we going to do this? We are going to... Uh, no, we are going to... No, we are going to... Yep. So this comes out like this and like that. Okay. So this will come out to about here like that as will this. Hmm. Okay, now if we take that. No, 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 that's about right. We want it to come in along here. Yeah. Okay. What we don't want it to do. is uh, go too far. Okay, now that we've done that, we can do this. Yep. And then you can take that out. Yeah, yeah, I can. Okay. Now what are you going to do? You're going to rejigger some more stuff, aren't you? Yeah, I rather suspect I am. Uh, okay, take that out. Now, we come in with a track that comes in like that, and then comes around like this. Yes. Okay. Okay, so that gets us a thing. Gets us a thing. Wow, we are articulate today. Yeah, yeah, we, we rather are. Now, if we bring that up like that, can we bring this up here? Okay, and we can get it to cross. Yeah. No, we're not going to do it that way. Uh, we don't have the uh, ability to make things quite that complicated. So we're going to do this. 
Come on. Do that. Do too much curvature. Where? Okay, do that. Um, and then we come out like this. Yep. And then we come out here. Uh, like, no, from about here. Aha, we can do that. Okay. Yes, good. Now from here, we can do that. Really? Okay, so we do that. Yep. Okay. Now bang a signal in here. And one in here. And one in here. And one in here. Yeah. That gives us room for a full train to queue in there. Uh, and then we can do this. And this. Yep. And bang a signal in here. Yes. That, I think, works. Good. Go get your depot again. Okay. Um, what are we running on here? Um, delivery. We are running one of those, which is uh, details 60, 16 uh, boxcars, right? Yeah, okay. Uh, 98, 100, yeah, okay. Well, we're going to buy vehicles, and that's going to be a, uh, well, we don't have electric or diesel, so it'll be a steam, and... What's this? Baldwin 56. Baldwin 56 will do. And cargo is going to be a boxcar. Uh, that one. Yeah. Yep, that's about right. We're going to buy two of these, right? Uh, we'll park that one over here. We'll close that. And train 45, we'll get a new line, which will go from here, way over here, to here. Yeah. Nice. Okay. And this is going to be... Uh, right. So this is going to be Dog River Food, right? Dog River Food to Shangri-La Delivery, right? Yeah. Where is it? There it is. Uh, cargo Train... Dog River Food to Shangri-La Delivery. Bang. Okay. And we'll do this. And this will be a new line going from here. And it's going to come way down here to here. And this is going to be Cargo Train uh, Dog River Food to Atlantis Delivery. Okay. Close that. Now, what are we going to do? We're going to ride the train is what we're going to do. Uh, you know, we're going to start the clock up. Yeah. So we're going to ride the train. Uh, well, we're going to have to wait for that train to leave first. What if we up the tempo? Yeah, if we up the tempo, that might, uh, that might get things moving faster. Okay, 
away that train goes. And then we should be able to get out on the track soonish. Look at that. We got a nice view. Okay, now we're moving. Now we got to spend a little bit of time getting to Dog River. And then we need to spend some time going to Atlantis. Okay, so we're just going to tick along here for a bit. So it looks like uh, you know, some, you know, something to talk about while we're riding along the train here. So it looks like uh, there's a major update coming this summer for Transport Fever 2. And the most recent, as of recording this, uh, announcement from the developers is that uh, there's some timetabling support coming for, uh, uh, for, for station scheduling and so on. Uh, so that should uh, that should have some uh, interesting impacts, uh, especially once the modders get at it. It looks um, so. It looks like it allow uh, denser networks uh, or uh, uh, you know some more uh, uh, smoothly running rail networks at least, and it might allow for some more smoothly running passenger networks as well. Uh, road networks, you know, buses and so on, uh, I think uh, with uh, some timetabling support could be improved qu quite a bit. Anyway, that uh, that's not necessarily a, uh, a bad development. Uh, they're apparently fixing a whole bunch of other stuff too, but that's the most recent one I noticed that was uh, somewhat exciting, is that they're uh, doing some work on scheduling. And in we go over here. Yep. And we're going to... We're going to pick something up on the way out. So there's that. And we're going to pick up... 23 food. Hey, not, not terrible. Uh, okay. Now on our way out again. Yeah, anyway, the scheduling thing also uh, be able to specify some uh, maximum wait times and, and minimum wait times. Uh, I'm not sure how well that's going to work. Uh, hopefully it's a maximum absolute wait time, not a, you know, like it's wait times based on absolute time at the platform rather than uh, time since the last... Um, uh, uh, item was loaded or unloaded. Okay, here we go. We're uh, we're crossing the uh, river here. So this is our our new bridge from last time. And here we go. Now we're on to our old uh, main line on the uh, on the the original uh, line here. We might need to quad track this and then use some waypoints to disambiguate some things. Yeah, we might. Okay, we're bypassing the town here. Then we should veer right. Yep, okay. Okay, and we pick up the passenger tracks here. And uh, merge with them. You know this uh, <clears throat> this map, even when it's fully developed, is going to have some uh, some pretty good uh, long runs with the trains. Uh, I, th I I like it. So 
uh, my goal for making the map, hello autosave, was kind of to get this, you know, and then you can sit back and ride trains around, right? Okay, we're coming through the uh, cut there. And then... Okay, we come across this valley. I'm going to have to connect up some more food producers, uh, or grain producers. Farms, that's what they're called. Uh, we connect up some more farms, probably, as well. But this was the main project for this time around. Um, right. We're going uphill here, aren't we? Huh. Okay. Uh, we're just about to come up to the tunnel, I think. Yeah, I think we should be coming up on the tunnel right away. There it is. The tunnel. And then we're going to have our new split off there. And off we go. Okay, this is our new line. Uh, freight line up around the side there. So we come around the top of uh, Shangri-La, I think it was. Yeah, Jolly Green there is okay. And then we, uh, we blast through on the bypass. Yep. And along we go here into Atlantis. Okay. Let's uh, jump out. Oh, we got a whole bunch of stuff came available. And uh, we'll slow down time and we can observe the 965k. So this will be profitable when we have slightly more... Uh, stuff to uh, let's um, let's ride this back the other way uh, just a little bit I just want to see what what some things look like coming this direction we have coming up the hill right And then through the bypass, yeah. Then around the top of the town. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this is this is uh this is okay. Uh I'm good with it. And I just want to see the junction here. Yep, the junction's fine. Okay. Well, that has definitely got a little bit more going on up here. Uh, I think at some point we'll be able, we'll also probably run another bypass track through here and uh, come up to Avalon for the uh, deliveries there. Um, yeah. Uh, But we're not producing bricks or uh, goods yet, so we don't need to. So instead, what I want to do is look in here and see that we're... Oh, we got 60... We got a fair amount headed for Atlantis. Uh, so, yeah, uh, we definitely need to get uh, more uh, farms connected, right? Now we've got... A farm over here that we can also connect up and I'm gonna do that right now uh, okay so that's gonna require one of these and we'll just uh, wang it around like this 
and uh, just uh, bang it in like that, right? And if we grab a track, we can do this. Yep, it'll swan neck around a bit. But, uh, well, we'll rejigger this at some point. But uh, this will do for now. And we will put a signal there. And a signal. Set of signals here. Okay. Yep. And then we can just uh, grab uh, a... Uh, Uh, train now what what are we uh, running here uh, okay I think we can just I think we can add um, yeah so if we manage the vehicles we can add one on there and we go here and we manage the vehicles uh, we can add one on there uh, and that is uh, also, we come up here, yeah, and we're going to buy a uh, Baldwin, because uh, that's uh, 284.70, uh, yeah, yeah, we'll grab a Baldwin, and we'll do cargo, and it's going to be gondola, that one. Okay, and we're going to put three on that one as well. New line from here to here. Yeah, okay. Now, this is, uh, do this, that is farm number 10, okay. Uh, CTW CFV farm number 10 collector. Yes. Yes, that is right. Okay. And then this is going to be, uh, farm number 10. Yes. Okay. Good. Right. Yes. Uh, okay, now if we jump on here and we look in here, you are doing something. Right, you're driving down the uh, track, that's what you're doing. Okay, so we come around. We have our river crossing, right? Then we blast through Winchesterton Fieldville and do our thing. Now, I suspect I'm going to end up running some shunting or something over here, which will uh, which will probably uh, uh, mean I got some even busier stations, but we don't have the uh, the freight capacity to do much more than what we're we're going to be doing here. Okay, are we c coming up on the town? No, we're going past a farm. Yeah. Then we come up. No, the next one's going to be the town. Right. Yes. Okay. Right, because we had to go around the nose of the the uh, the mountain thing there. Right. Then we come around here into... Right. I forgot there was a viaduct over here. Right, that that worked out really nicely. Uh, we blast through the trees. Yep. And then we swan neck a bit around. Yeah, and then we go and pick up our uh, our cargo over here. Right. 
And that should be a full load. Uh, yeah. And then we should have another one not too far behind. Yep, there is one. There's a train coming there. Uh, oh, there, there's one waiting here. Right. Yeah, so that's going to be uh, substantially full. Okay. Right? And the next one is not going to be full at all, but that should uh, speed up our food production over here. Right? Uh, so here, uh, we're transporting 100%. Uh, we're producing nothing because we don't have any supplies. That's why. Now, our drop-off platforms are which ones? Um, terminals. Collector, platform 2. Collector, platform 4. Uh, we'll move that to platform 2 as well. Um, yeah. Okay. Now we're going to drop off some stuff here. Right? Yeah, we're going to need more trains traveling in and out of here uh, at a fairly heavy uh, rate. Okay, we're gonna drop off here. Um, yeah, we definitely need more trains coming in. Uh, do I need to make this uh, roll on, roll off so that the throughput's a li little better? Hmm. Well, that's something to consider. Okay, we got another train coming in. Yep good we have more trains come yeah okay okay yeah, so our problem is supply at this end right now Okay. Well, that's definitely something that's going to need um, uh, a balancing or expansion or whatever. So we definitely need more more food coming this way or, or more grain. So that's uh, that's definitely going to be a thing. Okay. So we get another drop off here. And that's going to, yeah, that's going to increase things a little bit more. We got more. Okay, so we've got a pretty steady number of uh, grain trains uh, running along here. Uh, we, we clearly could stand a few more. Um, yeah, we'll add another one on there. Yeah, I think we can handle another one on there, and here, yeah, yeah, I think we can handle four on each, yeah, so we'll do that, and I think that's going to possibly be enough for these guys to level up. Uh, and then things will start uh, producing, you know, twice, twice as much. Yeah. I mean, we're getting four million per delivery on, on these things, right? So, whoops. Um, yeah. Yeah.
Okay, so that, yeah, okay. So it takes a long time for this stuff to filter through. Uh, right. Well, what I'm going to do while I'm noticing this uh, issue, I'm going to put an extra set of signals there and an extra set here. Yeah. And extra ones here and here so they can bunch up a little bit more uh, in that area right okay right that's a pickup train right um yeah Okay, so these guys looking at a level up, or they were. Uh, so it, yeah, it's just not enough delivered in that sh in that period of time. Yeah. Okay. So overall, uh, I'd have to say that uh, things are uh, looking looking up here. Uh, I think maybe next time I'll uh, plumb in maybe the rest of these. And I'll maybe do that with a shunt uh, from these up to here. And then we make this station bigger and run longer trains, maybe. Yeah. Maybe. That might make sense here, actually. I'll have to ponder that. Uh, okay. So, um, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if we can realistically run really long trains on there, but uh, not with the the current uh, uh, loco power and stuff. But uh, ultimately, uh, I think we'll have to do that. Uh, do a, a shunting operation and run big trains. Yeah. Uh, it's just so we can get the capacity through, right? But overall, uh, things do seem to be uh, working out. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm going to call that a part, and then I'll think about what we can do, uh, do later. Uh, yeah. Because uh, I'm also going to need to uh, connect this up into this, this operation and deliver food to actually to Dog River too. Right, okay, so that's all for this this episode. Uh, we got lots to do uh, next time, still. Possibly the farms here, possibly rejigger stuff around Dog River. Uh, I'll have to think about it. Eh, there's a minute or two before I need to record that, so, you know, there's that. Anyway, uh, stay healthy. Don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. At least where I am, things are looking up. And they actually are uh, at this point. Uh, so uh, I guess uh, we, we can just uh, leave off with uh, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, or not, as you see fit. Uh, apparently it helps some things. Maybe you get notified of some things if you do. Up to you. And see you back next time.